Robo Rock Picker, the new way to pick rocks fast and clean. This brand new revolutionary design is the world's first rotary rock picker built for skid loader mount. Robo fits on any skid loader with standard flow hydraulics and can pick from 2 inch to 36 inch rocks. Now you can pick rocks in heavy residue, corn stubble, sod and even wet fields two to three times faster than a rock bucket. Simply scoop, spin and your rocks are picked clean. Got tough hidden rocks? No problem. Robo can gouge rocks that are buried flush in hard ground in a single pass. The barrel can hold up to a ton of rocks, three to four times more than your average rock bucket, meaning fewer trips to the rock pile and more time to get the job done. No more arm fatigue from shaking your bucket till the dirt falls out, rocks spilling out of the bucket or carrying buckets of dirt and corn stubble to your rock pile. The conventional way of picking rock with pool type rock pickers and rock buckets require ideal conditions with dry soil and at a time when you should be planting. With the expensive cost of hybrid corn seed, you can't afford to delay planting while you pick rock. With Robo, you gain an extra month of picking time each year. Robo gives you a bigger window of opportunity to pick your rocks. In the fall, after you disc rip your cornfields, start picking, pushing rocks, corn stubble, dirt and mud into the barrel. Simply scoop, spin, and your rocks are picked clean. In the fall, you can pick till there's two inches of frost in the ground. And in the spring, you'll be in your fields picking rocks two to three weeks earlier than your neighbors because picking in wet conditions is no problem for Robo. Robo can pick in all conditions. No need to run your skid loader at full throttle. Robo works just as fast at half throttle, cutting your fuel costs by as much as 50%. With Robo, you get clean screened rocks with no dirt or debris. Now you can sell your rocks for top dollar to local contractors and landscapers. With the current cost of farming equipment, you can't afford not to pick your rocks. Rock rollers only prolong the agony caused by field rocks, planting basketball-sized boulders back into your field. The average farmer makes nine passes in his field with different equipment each year giving you the chance to hit the same rock nine times, year after year after year. Robo will pay for itself with the savings you'll have on fixing rock damaged equipment. Give yourself peace of mind, do what professional farmers do, and pick your rock with Robo. Robo doesn't cost $50,000, not even $20,000. No, for around $5,000, you can own a Robo and have the world's first rotary rock picker that is revolutionizing the way that farmers pick rock. Robo is made in Minnesota of solid steel and comes with a warranty ensuring you many years of trouble-free use. Robo should last the average farmer a lifetime. You deserve to own a Robo, making your life much easier and your kids a lot happier. I'm Jerry Dick from Grove City, Minnesota, and I bought a Robo rock picker. Hi, I'm Dave Lanners from Royalton, Minnesota. I just bought a Robo rock picker. I'm John Hoffman from Piers, Minnesota, and I bought a Robo rock picker. David Coon from Foley, Minnesota, and I bought a Robo. Hi, this is David Tremor from Lake Henry Piers Implement, and we sell Robo rock pickers. We well, have many, many years by hand with rock buckets. Uh, the Robo definitely does a nicer job cleaning the rocks out. Um, it's enabled us to pick a lot more rock before we run the planter across it, and save us a lot of work of picking it by hand later. It's maintenance, it's uh, maintenance free pretty much. Around here we do got a roller, you know, if you don't have time to pick them, we do push them in the ground. But after a while, you know, you, you keep pushing them back in the ground with the roller, you know, you keep getting more and more rocks, so, so eventually you got to go pick them, and the roller is the way to go, I think. You pick these rocks up and just give it a uh, drama spin and the dirt's all gone and you know, head for the next one, and it, uh, it's really uh, it's just amazing how much you can get done in a day. We didn't want to really go in the beams because we thought the ground was too hard. We rolled the beams and thought you couldn't get the rocks out. Pops them right out. As long as you can get the skid loader to drive across the decent, you can pick the rocks off of it. We have experienced very little service work on these units and they have really held up in our tough environment around here. I've picked rocks <laughs> all my life <laughs> and uh, this is the way to go.